All right, YouTube, I just got back from my coin show that I went to today. Uh, I'm pretty happy with what I got. Uh, a little disappointed in some things, but I will tell you about it. Um, I got a 26 uh, standing Liberty quarter that I have been looking for. I got a pretty good deal on it. Not too much. Well, I don't know, maybe. Maybe it paid too much, maybe I didn't. I liked it, so I picked it up. Um, this is actually the jewel of what I picked up this week, or this today. It is a 63 uh, Franklin half, and it is pretty much a proof-looking coin, except for two blemishes on the coin. See there. Pick them up. Let's see. Well, you can see it from there. But other than that, this coin is a fan fantastic coin. And I just had to get it for the price that they were selling it at. I got another Washington Silver Quarter to add to my collection. A Barber Dime. Or, I mean, a Mercury Dime. 1920. S. I'm going to actually be starting the uh, Mercury Dime series um these are two nickels or half dimes i believe they're nickels yeah um i don't know much about them at all but the guy had their half off on marked prices so i got these both for two dollars so i just had to get them steal for me i got a barber quarter First barber quarter that I got. It's in decent condition, not too bad. Then I got two walking liberties. And I got five Mercury Dimes that are going to be going into my series. These I got for a steal. I got for a dollar sixty-five a piece that I just I couldn't pass up. But I found these when I was coming close to my ending of the coin show, so couldn't get more. This one though has some awesome toning. I'm not not sure if the camera can pick it up that well. Uh, yeah, the camera's not doing it justice. And the bullion price is there that even though the price on bullion went down today a little bit, um, their prices were just so high that I, I couldn't walk out with just only one. So kind of be, uh, kind of upset about that because I plan on grabbing some uh, cheap silver. But I did find a 2013 Chinese Panda for only $28 that won't too bad uh, in my opinion but uh, I definitely see why these cost so much now because this is my first panda that I've seen in um, person and these are a beautiful beautiful uh, coin and I would like to definitely start collecting these coins That's everything I've picked up today. Um, I will make another video on some of the coins that I've inherited um, from my grandmother. They're not silver coins, but there are coins that I've had for a while now that I would like to show you because I've recently uh, find the appeal in them, even though that they're not silver. But I will show you those in the next video. Um, don't forget to give me a thumbs up, subscribe, and uh, leave a comment in the section below, and I'll catch you guys later.